The polls have closed. Counting is underway. Millions of voters across the United Kingdom have been choosing their new political leaders and passing judgment on the coalition. Across the country, people have voted in the first national referendum for a generation. Tonight on Sky News, it's decision time. Good evening. Today has seen the biggest set of elections in mon political history and the biggest test so far for the coalition. In Wales, Scotland and Northern Ireland, voters have been choosing new governments. In England, millions have gone to the polls to decide their local councils. Tonight, the public gives its verdict on the first peacetime coalition government for over 80 years. Now, tomorrow, we're going to get the results of the referendum on changing the voting system. But before then, David Cameron's Conservatives will have to endure what is expected to be a torrid night in English local council elections and in Scotland and Wales, too. For Nick Clegg, the next 24 hours are all about survival. He voted in Sheffield this morning knowing that big losses tonight are on the cards, along with defeat for the campaign to introduce the alternative vote. And all of that could trigger a leadership challenge. The Labour leader Ed Miliband is banking on big gains in England to boost his own leadership and take the edge off what's expected to be a difficult night for his party in Scotland. As ever, we'll have all the results as they come in, as well as breaking news from the key locations across the country. In a moment, we'll be hearing from our correspondents covering the races in Wales and in Birmingham. But first to Scotland. James Matthews is in Aberdeen.